What's going on guys, it's Jeff for Premium Aquatics and today we're going to be taking a look at the Reef Octopus Essence 130 Protein Skimmer. What's going on guys, I'm back with another video to help you make the most informed decision that you can when it comes to buying equipment for your reef tank. And today we're going to be taking a look at a new skimmer by Reef Octopus, it is the Essence 130. So let's jump into it. Alright folks, so we're going to be taking a look at the Reef Octopus Essence 130 and we're going to do a little unboxing and then we're going to get into how to set it up. So what Reef Octopus did with the Essence 130 is they took the features of all their best protein skimmers and put it into one single unit. So we're going to take a look at a couple of the specs that are involved with the Essence 130 and start with the footprint and work up from there. The footprint of this protein skimmer is just over six and a half inches by eight inches. This protein skimmer stands at a total of 20 and a half inches and what this does is it makes the protein skimmer more effective at removing waste from the water column. So the benefit of the Essence 130 is it has a small footprint so it's not going to be taking up a lot of space in your sump. It's very tall and what that's going to do for you it's going to increase contact time with the bubbles that it produces so it's going to produce very thick dark skim mate. So when it comes to purchasing a protein skimmer these are the things that you want to look for. The Essence 130 has a decent sized collection cup. It measures five and a half inches which is a really big collection cup for this size protein skimmer. The cup also features a plug which can be removed and you can attach a hose which they've also provided and run it into a collection bucket. What this can do for you is it helps reduce the need for maintenance with the protein skimmer. Another great feature of this protein skimmer is the quick connects which help make maintenance and cleaning the protein skimmer extremely fast and easy. And the benefit of something being fast and easy is it's more apt to happen if you can do it quick. A protein skimmer should really be detailed clean every six months to a year and what this does is help ensure that it's going to last you a very long time. Now that we have everything out of the package it's time to put the Essence 130 together and I was really impressed as to how quick I could get this protein skimmer up and running. So it's always important before you put something together especially when it comes to aquarium stuff that you read the instructions and safety instructions to make sure that you're keeping yourself and others safe and as far as assembly goes with this protein skimmer i was really impressed overall it was really fast and easy to do so the first step was to disconnect the base plate from the protein skimmer and there's a little ridge that you slide the pump onto that base plate and next to the quick connects i think my second most favorite feature of this protein skimmer was the wire sleeve which makes a really clean transition from the pump sitting on the base plate to the power cord running out of the protein skimmer after I had the pump in place, it was time to connect the bubble plate, and it kind of made me nervous pushing that down onto the pump, but I realized after I got it in place that that can unscrew, very similar to how a collection cup unscrews from the top of a protein skimmer. So I would recommend if you are going to pick up this protein skimmer that you remove that plate before installing it onto the pump. So once you have everything in place, and then reconnect the body to the base plate, and put the Venturi onto the pump, it is time to connect. You connect the adjustable valve and water outlet pipe to the protein skimmer. It's really easy to do, it connects on the top and then it just kind of sits into the bottom plate. Then once that is in place, you connect the airline tubing to the Venturi and the neck of the protein skimmer and then slide the collection cup into the neck and you are ready to go it's that easy and at this point if you want to run a collection bucket this is the time that you would connect the hose to the collection cup you remove the plug and slide on the hose and then take the other end of the hose and put it into a bucket so what that will do for you it's going to reduce the amount of maintenance that you're going to do for your protein skimmer and a really amazing feature on this protein skimmer is that it has click dial control so if you're tuning your protein skimmer and you figure out that number 12 is a sweet spot on your tank then when you do maintenance you clean up the protein skimmer and then you go back and then you set up the protein skimmer to 12. This click dial control really makes tuning your protein skimmer very easy and repeatable. And essentially what this click valve does for the protein skimmer is it removes the guessing game out of tuning your protein skimmer. All right, folks, that's going to do it for our look at the Reef Octopus Essence 130. If you want to check this protein skimmer out, there's a link in the description below. 
All right, guys, that's going to do it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please make sure you hit the thumbs up. If you're new to Premium Aquatics, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date every time that we upload a new video. That's going to do it for today. I'll see you guys next time right here with a brand new video.